four of us, we have a couple of uh, new people who joined us in today. So let's start in with Markova, who has looked significantly different than she did when she first joined us. <laughs> so, so, so you had a, a whole story. So let, let's get a little bit into uh, what exactly happened with you on the way in today. Oh, I was just like a little bit late because um, I was at the grocery store like hours ago. Mm-hmm. And uh, I was like, yeah, no, I got plenty of time. Things are chilling. But this old lady, man, she, like, just right in front of us, like, just fell over and, like, smacked her head on the ground. And it was Whoa. Like, yeah. yeah, it was, like, this whole thing. She was this sweet old lady. And it was actually kind of funny because everyone's like, you know, are you all right? And even if you seem all right, it's not like she had blood or anything. It was fine. But mm-hmm. even still, like, you know, you can get a concussion. And especially when you're older, you have, like, more brittle bones. You have hairline fracture. It's just not like a safe thing to just like then like go home and fall asleep, you know. But she yeah, was like, "Do definitely. not send an ambulance." She's like, "Do not take me to hospital. I'll be there all night. Like I want to go, <laughs> go home." And it was like this whole thing about like, "Well, you shouldn't drive," like, <laughs> you know. And um, but it was kind of funny because they were like, kind of, oh, you know. So do you know what? Like, who's the president? And like asking questions. She was like, "It's not my president. It's Biden." <laughs> 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 and, That's like, wow. yeah. She's like, he's not my president. Bye. And like, she's like being all about it. But it, and this is New York. I'll it's say, little, I see. Yeah. And like, it's New York. So people don't realize like how New York is like outside of the city. But like, I'm outside of the city mm-hmm. right now and like upstate yeah. a bit. And it's just like everyone there was like, like bitching about like the register lady was just like another old lady. And she's like, oh yeah, you know, you got to get these points, you know, you should get a card because these points rack up and you know, with the gas prices getting up to $6. Right? <laughs> and, it, and it was just like, everybody up here is like totally pro Trump, anti Biden type of thing. But yeah, anyway, my husband then had to like drive her, um, you know, drive her home and then like get a ride back. And it was just like turned into like this like hours long thing. So, wow. Oh, well, that was nice, but definitely very nice. Yeah, yeah, I mean, it's just like I have like a particularly bitchy grandmother. I call her Bubba because I'm I'm Croatian, and oh. she's just like <laughs> super bitchy, super Slavic like old lady who's just like nasty. Like I don't know, man. I don't know if it's a Croatian <laughs> thing, but she's the bitchiest old lady in the world. And it's like this sweet old lady was like, "Can you be my grandma? <laughs> I'm gonna go visit her." And be like, "You all right? <laughs> Did you make that banana yeah. bread for church, lady?" <laughs> well, That's what well, she was well, there for. Unlike Martina, who buried the entire country of Croatia just because of her grandmother. But we're glad that you joined <laughs> us here here tonight, right. and hope they have some fun. And then we want to go 